Welcome to the Daily Radio Bible for Kids. The date is July the 16th. My name is Hunter, and we are reading through the Bible. That's something we do every day. We take time in God's Word. We let His Word take its time on us. In fact, kids from all around the world gather here to listen to these amazing stories from the Bible, from Genesis all the way to the book of Revelation. And today we are back in the Gospel of Mark, chapter 6. Jesus was teaching more than 5,000 people. Everyone was getting hungry. But there wasn't any food around. Would everyone have to go home? Let's read about it. Mark chapter 6. The apostles returned to Jesus from their ministry tour and told him all they had done and taught. Then Jesus said, Let's go off by ourselves to a quiet place and rest a while. He said this because there were so many people coming and going that Jesus and his apostles didn't even have time to eat. So they left by boat for a quiet place where they could be alone. But many people recognized them and saw them leaving, and people from many towns ran ahead along the shore and got there ahead of them. Jesus saw the huge crowd as he stepped from the boat, and he had compassion on them because they were like sheep without a shepherd. So he began teaching them many things. Late in the afternoon, his disciples came to him and said, This is a remote place, and it's already getting late. Send the crowds away so they can go to the nearby towns and villages and buy themselves something to eat. But Jesus said, You feed them. With what, they asked. We'd have to work for months to earn enough money to buy food for all these people. How much bread do you have? he asked. Go and find out. They came back and reported. We have five loaves and two fish. Then Jesus told the disciples to have the people sit down in groups on the green grass. So they sat down in groups of fifty or a hundred. Jesus took the five loaves and two fish, looked up toward heaven, and blessed them. Then breaking the loaves into pieces, he kept giving the bread to the disciples so that they could distribute it to the people. He also divided the fish for everyone to share. They all ate as much as they wanted. And afterward, the disciples picked up 12 baskets of leftover bread and fish. A total of 5,000 men and their families were fed from these loaves. (laughs) Amazing. Jesus performed an amazing miracle. Not only did he keep the people from being hungry, but he showed them that he had God's power. Jesus took care of his followers in the same way that God provided manna for the Israelites in the desert. Jesus felt compassion for them because they were like sheep without a shepherd. And here he was, the shepherd of Israel, feeding his flock. Wonderful. We can trust God to shepherd us because he's a good shepherd. We can trust him to feed us and meet all of our daily needs because he cares for us. He has compassion for us. In fact, Jesus instructed us to pray that God would give us our daily bread that we would go to God for that bread. So let's do that. Let's go to God, our great shepherd. Let's go to God, the one who provides for all our needs. Let's look to him for our whole life. Hey, we've done it. We've done it again. We've spent another day in the Bible. I plan on being back here again tomorrow to do the same thing, Lord willing. Lord willing and the creek don't rise, I plan on being here. Until tomorrow, let's go forward in God's joy. Let's let his joy be our strength. And let us always remember this, that you are loved. No doubt about it. Alrighty, I'll talk to you again tomorrow. You guys take care. Bye-bye.